Welcome to Jog on Jargon, a series where we simplify self-employment by explaining business waffle in plain English in under two minutes. When we talk about people going self-employed, we often talk about sole traders and limited company directors. When these individuals work for an end client and provide services to them personally, it's important that their employment status is established and the correct amount of tax paid. Recent changes in tax laws, known as IR35, mean many end clients believe appointing a contractor using a limited company is no different to employing the individual directly. If the end client wants the flexibility of engaging a contractor and the contractor is happy with the arrangement, they will ask the contractor to use an umbrella company if the assignment contract and working practices mean it's needed. An umbrella company or service sits between the contractor and the end client, or agency if there's one involved. The umbrella company employs the contractor and is responsible for all employment taxes and employment support. Many contractors prefer to work through an umbrella company as it gives them peace of mind, their employment taxes are taken care of, and they don't need to worry about chasing clients to pay for their services. The process is usually simple. You do the work and complete timesheets. Your end client authorizes the timesheet and sends an invoice to the umbrella company. The umbrella company then calculates your pay, deducts the necessary employment taxes, and its fee for processing your pay. You're also entitled to things like annual leave and statutory sick pay, as well as maternity or paternity pay and a workplace pension. Although these will be paid for from the fee the end client pays. Beware of unscrupulous umbrella companies promising higher take-home pay. These are usually illegal and may leave you facing unexpected tax bills or even prosecution. With tried and tested umbrella companies, as offered by Crunch Partners, you also get comprehensive insurance cover for public liability, employer's liability, and professional indemnity. If you think this might be the best route for you, or you're simply interested in learning more, then follow the link in the description below. Being self-employed or a company director has its own challenges, and the last thing you need is waffle or jargon making things more confusing. At Crunch, our experts will help you understand your tax requirements and do all of the number crunching so that you can get on with doing what you love. Visit crunch.co.uk to find out more about our award-winning online accountancy services and software.